other than that, we have used this occasion also to review the situation of uh, security in this county. Uh, when I was here, I remember uh, there was a bit of tension which had been brought by political people who were disrupting each other's functions, causing havoc, and we said it uh, very categorically at that time, and we repeat now, that no one will be allowed to engage in lawlessness, breach of peace, or disruption of public meetings. And those leaders who are using our young men and women to cause chaos and violence in meetings, uh, we said that we are going to arrest all of them. I am happy to report that we've progressed very well with the investigations and we expect to be making arrests uh, in the coming days of all those who have been organizing, uh, financing, and orchestrating violence here so that it can serve as a deterrent uh, and nobody repeats that kind of behavior again. I said that time and I repeat now, nobody, and I repeat nobody is above the law. Number two, as security managers, we are not interested with the political persuasion of the offenders. If you break the law, it doesn't matter your political persuasion, we will arrest you. It doesn't matter your status in society, we will arrest you. We will prosecute you and we will make sure that you are punished in accordance with the laws of our country. The culture of intolerance, violence and Goonism is a matter that is worrying us as security people, not just here in Kisi, in other parts of the country as well. And we are convinced beyond doubt that unless we nip this problem in the, in the bud, we, we nip this problem now, unless we destroy the infrastructure of violence that is developing, which is politically instigated, these criminals will organize themselves and mutate into other crimes. And it will be very difficult to enforce the law and maintain law and order in our country going forward. 